All right, hey, it's Space Word Bird, and uh, yes, back with another uh, weeknight YouTube video. Uh, playing some video games today. Today we're playing some NBA 2K19, not for long, uh, playing some My Team. Now, the purpose of today's vid, I've uh, been meaning to make this vid for a while. Uh, you'll see it in a lot of our YouTube videos. Uh, we run this J.R. Smith-inspired jersey, and when we do, we get a lot of comments on our vids asking how do we get uh, the Henny God skins look on the basketball court. Uh, we would love to take credit for these amazing jerseys, but we cannot. Uh, definitely not that talented. Uh, these jerseys were created by a super talented YouTuber named Skills from the Six. Uh, there is a link to his channel uh, and the tutorial vid in the video description below. Uh, today's video, we're going to do a quick walkthrough on how you can add these jerseys and then do what we do best. That's run a quick game of uh, triple threat with these jerseys equipped. Uh, and of course, we'll be running the new Galaxy Opal J.R. Smith in that lineup. Now to get started, uh, if you're totally new to my team, uh, you do need to unlock the ability to create your own uniforms and team logo. Now to do that, it does take a little effort. Check it out. Uh, need to acquire a card with tokens that is not a big deal uh, you do need to complete a current team collection so you do need a little mt for that i uh, gotta buy a heat check card from the auction house that's not a big deal you can find those for pretty cheap uh the biggest hurdle reach captain collector level uh yeah now i know some people were pretty fired up at the start of the season uh with this little task yeah to reach captain you gotta collect 500 cards uh not something you do overnight uh, but it can be done uh, and then of course acquire a premium collection card also not a big deal ton of those out there for cheap so really the biggest hurdles uh finishing a current team set and having at least 500 cards collected uh to get 500 would recommend uh, grinding out Dom if you haven't, and then of course get a lot of franchise items like jerseys, playbooks, logos, coaches, get those for cheap in auction. Now once you've completed that goal, uh, you can start working and creating your J.R. Smith inspired jerseys. Uh, let's get started. Uh, go to your My Team tab, uh, go to Lineup Management, and then go to Franchise. Check it out. Uh, once there, you can begin to design your home and away uniforms. Get started with our home unis. Uh, settings to get started, uh, select Build Your Own, uh, and then for jersey color, that's not a big deal. Uh, I picked the eunuch, you can pick whatever. Uh, for jersey design, select none and then for jersey color this takes a little effort uh you can see here on the color wheel uh the approximate location of the little marker uh there is no perfect or exact setting play around with it a little and choose the color that you think works best now once you got that done uh for names and numbers uh for player names select none uh, for second player names select none and then for jersey back number uh you'll also want to select none uh jersey front number make sure that's turned off and jersey shorts number uh that's up to you on how you want to design your team shorts uh this vid we are focusing on how to create the shirtless jr smith jersey uh, now with that complete uh, you're going to go to images uh, and this is where you want to download the files from skills from the six and start adding layers now to make it simple for you uh, if you're on xbox search by user uh, enter party pete 95 all lowercase uh, with spaces between party pete and the number 95 uh, do that you should be able to find the images needed for the front and back of the jersey now once you've selected them created layers for them it does take a little work a little finesse to get them just right and again no perfect setting kind of eyeball it uh, covering the jersey with the tatted chest and back and then yeah boom you've done it once you got that completed you'll be able to run shirtless uh, on the triple threat and unlimited courts i know it's exciting looks cool as heck you know, it's also cool uh an added bonus in today's vid yeah, as promised some triple threat sweat gameplay and gonna get extra sweaty today uh pulling out galaxy opal shack from the collection yeah best card in the game this season also running galaxy opal jimmy butler uh this card from the token reward market and i uh, just picked up after i got back from vacation uh the new galaxy opal jr smith yeah me jr every season always a favorite card of mine to run in lineups uh volume shooter that's lethal from deep range and has strength playing making and athleticism to attack the rack with some flash and force. Uh, now the matchup, uh, the warning sign, dude's got a hidden gem known as Ruby Jonathan Isaac. Uh, also running Pink Diamond Boogie and Galaxy Opal Anthony Davis. And here, the pull-up from three with Cousins. Yeah, from straight on, he got it. Galaxy Opal Shaq here with some post-spin cheese to get around to Marcus Cousins. Yeah, triggering the classic backboard shattering throwdown animation. It'd be cool if you could break backboards on occasion in this game. Now Isaac in transition here. No hesitation. The pull-up from three, right side, and yeah, he got it. Struggling here. Boogie, Iso, and Shaq attempting to get low keep him in front does a pretty good job getting a good angle to disrupt the layup but it is not enough yeah ball hanging on the rim it drops it's not my day town four gonna keep pace and the stop would be helpful here on offense jr on the attack draws the help from ad butler open on the perimeter ad quick on the closeout butler stuck like velcro finally gets loose and gets the easy two points inside and isaac continuing to kill it here never able to get jr in front on defense yeah this ruby isaac card is nice like i said i just want to stop unable really to do that right now just trying to keep pace and here jr answers with a green light three from limitless range that's a pretty good answer aggressive on the defense on the inbounds pass Shaq unable to disrupt he's got to hustle back on defense out of position and again marcus cousins pulling threes like he's steph curry limitless range threes too yeah it's cash They're getting the dub this game down two possessions could use a three ball here butler open right corner and yeah he got it let's go a one point game and isaac missing the wide open look from three but the offensive board ad cleaning the glass giving isaac another open look from three he breaks it Danny davis again offensive board yes yeah, second 
second chance points, the kick out, the wide open Jonathan Isaac, third chance at an open three, and he breaks it again. Now, GG, Shaq the board and running the break. Now jump ahead here a little in time with the shot clock winding down. Look at Shaq work to get an open look. Here, find some open space, mid range, passes on it. Yeah, ball back to Butler. Then watch Shaq spot up from three. The quick shot release too, it's a green freaking light. Yeah, with one second left too on the shot clock, absolutely unreal. Shaq, love this card. The same situation on the other court. Shot clock winding down and it's Isaac on the attack and gets the teardrop to fall. Yeah, tie ball game. And then have no idea what happened here. Opponent just asleep at the controller. Allows J.R. Smith to take it straight to the hoop. Yeah, the late reaction from Isaac, not enough. And attacks with the flashy finish. But opponent with some fight. Yeah, the handoff cheese here and some confusion on defense to switch or not to switch. Somebody's got to guard Isaac. Open look from three. And yeah, this time he got it. Take a one point lead. We're playing to win. Uh, Shaq here with his takeover lit. Yeah, running the show. Uh, and with the diamond shoe, Shaq with 88 ball control, 94 acceleration, 84 speed with ball. And showing off the handles here. The point guard drives left, got Cousins on his hip, draws the hell from Isaac. And yeah, that leaves J.R. Smith wide open on the perimeter. Yeah, and that's ball game. Now that was some triple threat sweat. I hope you enjoyed the gameplay. It was good fun. And have some fun with these jerseys too. And again, make sure you check out skills from the six. Dude is super talented. Love his vids. Now equip him and uh, make sure you share some game clips with me. Uh, here's where you can find us on Twitter. That's all we got for you in today's vid. Uh, likes, always appreciate them. A little gesture says, yes, keep this upload streak rolling. More weeknight uploads. Oh, and subscribe if you're not subbed already. Don't want to miss out on the My Team fun as we get ready for NBA 2K20. Uh, for Party Pete, this is Space. We're out.